What is up, YouTube Knife Community? I'm back again today. Uh, like always, we're going to take a look at some mods. As I adjust the camera, hang on just a second. But um, <clears throat> yeah, we got several mods here to look at. A uh, bunch of them are for LTK and a couple other guys. But um, we'll start out with these uh, Best Tech Aridas, is what the name of them are. And uh, there's four of these, and they all four come from uh, Lee over at Love Them Knives. If you don't know who Lee is, go check him out, which I'm sure you do. But anyway, first up, uh, he did the die jobs on these. He's got a video out on it. If you want to check that out, go over to his channel. But uh, all the die jobs on these Aridas, he has done them. So first up, here's this green one. Uh, I anodized all the hardware, flame anodized most of it. Uh, and yeah, stonewash the blade not an acid wash just a stone wash i don't know if you can tell this or not but i stone washed the liners kind of hard to see but the liners have been stone washed so on this one that's all we did was a stone wash on the liners and the blade and then resharpened it there's the edge pretty nice edge on it uh so there's number one these are very nice knives. If you're looking for a, <laughs> a knife around that $100 range, I would highly recommend the, these. Um, they're in 14C28N, and Best Tech does a hell of a job building knives. So next up, this is another greenish one. Uh, I'm not sure what the different colors are. You could go check out his channel if you want to know uh, and watch his video. But on this one, again, we I anodized all the hardware. <clears throat> Actually, uh, electro anode, the titanium clip, and the titanium uh, pivot collars on all these, and then heat anodized the screws. So on this one, we did an acid etch and a stone wash, or acid wash. Check out the way these fullers came out. I love that. Just adds like a little bit of contrast to the blade. I don't know why they did that, but that's how they did it. It's almost like they didn't take the etch or something. It's pretty sweet. I like it. I'd like to say I did that on purpose, but obviously I didn't. But anyway, uh, acid wash the blade. Come on, focus. Acid wash the liners. These liners on these knives are, are super nice. They've got them chamfered on the inside corners, as you can see there. Uh, yeah, they pulled out all the stops on these. A little bit on the higher end of the budget line, but very nice. Uh, so the acid wash and then sharpened it, of course. There's the edge. I think it came out very nice. Uh, I hope he loves these. Uh, next up is another uh, Best Tech Arita, and this one's in purple. There it is. Again, flame anodized all the stainless hardware and electro anode, the titanium. This one also has been acid washed, resharpened, as you can see. These things have excellent action uh kind of a muted flipper tab i do like that uh when you reach by it, it's pretty much you know flush with the back side of the knife super nice knives uh pointy stabby slicey you got belly yeah they're pretty sweet i'll probably end up with one of these for myself definitely like them and next up again another best tech arita and this one is in purple as well i don't know if they're both the same colors yeah pretty much the same colors but again this one's been acid washed there you go sharpen again flame anodized the stainless electro anode to titanium i think it came out very nice very smooth action on all these guys they're running on uh bearings which is super nice so there's these guys next up is a sheepdog xl with uh canvas micarta deleted the flipper tab added the opening hole acid wash blade acid wash liners if it'll focus come on focus acid wash liners heat anodized pocket clip and screws lift the pivot collars blue and there she is very nice knife again super smooth easy to deploy 
either thumb flick or spidey flick either way is easy to do there it is super nice and uh just for shits and giggles i'll show you a uh this is what it looked like when it came to me there it is darkened the uh, micarta just a little bit there it is came out super nice i enjoy it a uh, very nice knife so next up is a uh another sheep dog but this one is the uh the titanium and s35 en it's got the lightning strike anode Let's see if i can show it off try this one more time so uh i wanted like a blue to bronze fade there's a finger smudge there as you can see but this shit's hard to show off in this kind of light but there it is added the uh opening hole again deleted the flipper tab added a chool been acid washed came out very nice i think i wish i could show you the anno but it starts out blue on this end and fades into bronze i like it i dig it super smooth very nice knife feels good in the hand yep i dig it love it all right, next up is a PM2, and this guy is for sale if anybody's interested in it. Uh, this is a, well, come on, Maximet. Got an acid wash on it. The liners have, or yeah, the liners have been acid washed too. They're gonna be hard to see, but there they are. These, this is wearing flytanium scales, titanium from flytanium got a lynch clip it's been anodized by me and the hardware is from flytanium as well the screw set the lanyard tube is also anodized purple so the scales it's called a vibrant purple but it looks more like a blue to me and then everything else is anodized uh purple but there it is super smooth action very nice knife it's got just a touch of lock stick which isn't bad it'll work itself out uh it came to me like that. This knife is brand new. It was brand new before I started the mods. So it needs to be broke in. And I've got a uh, a 600 grit working finish on the edge here. Very, very sharp knife. But uh, yeah, this one's for sale if anybody's interested. Uh, I posted it on my Instagram for 280 If anybody's interested in it, I'll sell it for 260 Uh it sounds high but the knife itself is 214 by itself the scales are about 70 bucks if you buy them new the hardware is about 35 and the clip is 25 so do the math i have way more than that in it but yep i'm i'm willing to sell it for that if anybody's interested but there's that and if you're interested in any knife mods and you want to hit me up this is how you get in touch with me there it is uh that's all i got on this one uh lee thank you so much for the business man uh it's always a pleasure working with you uh keep them coming send all you want and we will pump them out brother uh anyways guys that's all i've got i don't know if i showed the edge off on this one there it is thank you guys so much for watching thanks for stopping by uh and i'll see you guys on the next one